My name is Anna Calhoun and I'm a nurse midwifery student at Vanderbilt University School of Nursing. My name is Ali Sevilla de Coco and I am a dual nurse midwifery and family nurse practitioner student at Vanderbilt University School of Nursing. The STEP clinic is a specialty clinic of the Shade Tree Clinic and the Shade Tree Clinic is run by Vanderbilt University medical students. But the STEP clinic is run by two nurse midwifery students along with one medical student and we provide prenatal care to women who do not have health insurance um, and who are pregnant. Usually they're very early in their pregnancy and they are sometimes scared. Um, they don't know how to access prenatal care without insurance and so I talk to them on the phone and see if our clinic is something that is able to help them and if it is then we schedule them on, um, an appointment and if not I try to hook them up with other resources in the community to better meet their needs. So the clinic runs once a month and clinical teams that consist of a third or fourth year medical student as well as a nurse and referee student in the specialty year work as providers and the pre-specialty student from the nurse's midwifery program or a first or second year medical student work with patient assessment and education. And those teams present to and collaborate with a volunteer nurse midwife or a physician. And after clinic, um, we provide referrals for the women to continue their prenatal care. So there are many ways for nurse midwifery students to get involved with STEP. In the pre-specialty year, the um, student is able to help with patient assessment and education. And in the specialty year, they provide care in collaboration with the attending during the prenatal care visit. One of my favorite parts about being involved with STEP is that I get to see the way the healthcare system delivers care to women who um, are sometimes on the outside of care. And I get to see that from two perspectives. Um, I see it from a healthcare provider perspective, but also from the, the perspective of the woman seeking care. Um, and so I think it will help my future practice because I'll be thinking about how to best make my practice accessible to all women. Uh, one of the things that I love about STEP is the concrete reinforcement of what we're learning in the classroom. So every month we get to be reminded about what um, labs need to be drawn at a first prenatal care visit and we're reminded of diagnostic algorithms and we also get to see different types of bedside manner and how different that can look for every woman. And so we're able to think about our own strengths and what we might want to do in, in our own future practice about how we're going to deliver care to women who in many ways are, are pretty vulnerable. Another thing that I uh, really get to develop and learn at STEP is interprofessional communication and roles. Um, not only between the midwives and the doctors and the midwifery students and the medical students, but also between um, the healthcare providers that exist in the community. So often I'm talking to social workers and to um, other members of the community who have the same goal that I do, and that is to provide care to women that need it. I think one of the challenges of graduate school is of course trying to figure out how to balance school with um, being involved in the community. And I think STEP is a terrific opportunity to do that. I know that I went into Nurse Midwifery because I wanted to um, provide quality care to women from all walks of life. And sometimes I struggle to be able to keep up with my studies and also be involved in the national community. And STEP is a great way that, to keep that always in my, in my sight, that this is important work and there's always work to be done. And it's also a pretty unique care model and so we know that we are able to participate in something that isn't available at all advanced practice nursing programs.